Wait a minute. That's not woke Snow White. Isn't that Brett Cooper from The Daily Wire? Welcome back to the JP Reacts channel, my beautiful freedom-loving friend, where we like to call out the lies of backwards and corruption of tyrants, shine the light of awareness on woke absurdities, and highlight the amazing work of other freedom fighters. Highlighting some amazing work is what we're doing today. I am so impressed with what the Daily Wire is doing. What are they doing? Share that in a second, but first, part of what they're doing. You see, you saw just a few seconds of a clip from a movie they're producing, Snow White and the Evil Queen. Pretty interesting, coming in 2024. Why are they making Snow White? Get to one thought of, on that in a second, but first, another reason why they're making Snow White. Just the other day, the Daily Wire announced a major initiative. In fact, a new company they've formed where they're putting $100 million over the next three years into producing children's programs. That's a change we've needed in the world because we know there is dangerous content, deliberately dangerous, designed to infect the minds of children. Hello, Hollywood movies. Hello, woke Snow White. Hello, woke Disney. Dangerous stuff. Hey, here's some gender ideology stuff. Hey, uh, little boys, we're gonna teach you you're racist. And little boys, we're gonna teach you that masculinity is disempowering. All that kind of dangerous nonsense deliberately designed to infect the minds of children to demoralize our country so we're more easily controlled. We know we need to protect children from that because it's in entertainment, it's in books, it's in schools. But we also need more positive solutions because it's one thing to recognize the problem, but we need change makers making changes and producing children's content that is not only free of these harmful ideologies, but it actually is positive. It's a net gain. Whereas now when you watch Disney, it's a net loss. Oh, you might be entertained, but your children are getting degenerated in their mind. They're being taught to subscribe to ideologies that are not based on truth, they're not based on God, they are based on tyrannical evil, if you ask me. So you watch a normal Hollywood movie designed for children, you get a net loss. We need more things that are a net gain. And by the way, you know, one of my small contributions to that, uh, my children's book, Chomp, 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 you may have heard me talk about it before, it just launched. But I wrote this because I know we need to create positive solutions that instill good morals, pro-God, pro-America, pro-freedom into children, or else they're never gonna have a happy life. They'll be raised to be obedient. By the way, if you haven't got yourself a copy yet, bravebooks.com, you can check it out. But the Daily Wire, they operated a bigger scale than yours truly does. So I mentioned uh, their new company, it's called Bent Key. And this is the company that is designed to be the alternative for Hollywood. It's something that parents can turn to with reliable, good net gain programming for children. So take a quick look at their announcement. Introducing Bent Key, a new adventure in kids entertainment. It's been just one year since Disney, the most powerful entertainment company in the world, was caught saying the quiet part out loud, namely that they were using their brand a brand parents have been trusting with their children for generations to indoctrinate those children into the LGBTQIA cult. How so? You probably remember it, but let's refresh. In a leaked video, one of Disney's executive producers said she's implementing a not at all secret gay agenda and is regularly adding queerness to her kids' shows. Okay. So the Daily Wire, recognizing the loss of what Disney was and what it now unfortunately has become, says, recognizing the scope of this loss, the Daily Wire announced we will spend $100 million over three years to begin our own kids entertainment company. And today on the 100th anniversary of the day Walt Disney founded his company, I'm proud to announce the launch of ours. Introducing Bent Key, an entirely new company from the Daily Wire, a company dedicated to creating the next generation of timeless stories that transports kids into a world of adventure, imagination, and joy. This video is not sponsored by The Daily Wire. Uh, the Daily Wire deserves this praise. They're putting in so much effort, so much risk, so much money into creating the alternatives that we as parents know we need because we see the major problems. So I am just freaking inspired. I'm proud of what they're doing. And 
I can't wait. There's a part on the announcement article that says like, hey, why, why do you call it Bent Key and not just Daily Wire for kids? I love their response. Daily Wire Kids is just too political. Bent Key isn't about teaching kids politics. It's about childhood, wonder and adventure. It's about values and of all other things on which politics are built later. So I love that. It's not just like some better alternative cult to Disney and the dangerous gender ide ideologies like, hey, teach my kids the politics that I agree with. No, no, no. I love how they're deliberately not trying to bring politics into their entertainment. That's not appropriate for kids. It's using kids to further an agenda. Their new children's entertainment company, is about values, wonder, adventure, and imagination. Weird to hear about something that's appropriate for children. Ha! And of course, the Snow White and the Evil Queen movie that's slated for release in 2024, starring Daily Wire personality, Brett Cooper. She's got her background in acting. She's wildly popular on all the platforms with her commentary videos. I've met Brett Cooper, did a video with Brett Cooper. Maybe you saw it's coming out to your liberal parents as Christian. Put a link here in the description of this video if you haven't watched that. It's great. Brett Cooper is amazing. I'm looking forward to one day showing my son that movie when it comes out. Daily Wire has earned my trust, seeing what they stand for over the years, and it, it inspires me to do my best to an even greater degree to positively impact not only the world around me, but also more importantly, more preciously. Here's the fun question. Why is the Daily Wire making Snow White and the Evil Queen? I don't know. I haven't talked to insiders there, but here's my guess. Daily Wire has a playbook and it's worked majestically for them. Their playbook of something is woke, they literally make a solution to that exact thing. You probably remember some razor company. They sponsor Daily Wire content, but then the razor company went woke, dropped the Daily Wire. I think it was Harry's Razors. And then the Daily Wire immediately came out with their own razor company, Jeremy's Razors, and just made millions. They crushed it. It was so fun. And then Hershey's Chocolate went like even more woke than they had been. So Daily Wire comes out with Jeremy's chocolate. So the woke Snow White movie has gotten all kinds of publicity. And in my opinion, not the best publicity because it's showing their wokeness and their absurdities. So it wouldn't be surprising to me if the Daily Wire with her playbook saw that as like, hey, what we've learned, we can be incredibly successful if there's a glaring example of ridiculousness and we make something that is exactly counter to it, the exact alternative. The exact alternative for a woke razor company is a freedom-loving razor company. For a woke chocolate company, like freedom-loving chocolate company. And for woke Snow White, here's our version of Snow White. That's my speculation, maybe what motivated them to specifically make this Snow White movie. But I can't wait. I appreciate The Daily Wire and I was excited to see this news, so I wanted to share it with you along with these uh, opinions embedded within the news because I can't help myself. I have a voice. I'm gonna say what I think out loud. Sometimes I don't know what I think until I hear myself say it. Sometimes I'm surprised hearing myself tell me what I'm thinking. All right, I think it's time to end here. Look forward to seeing you on our, on our next video, my freedom-loving friend. But before that, I have a special message for you. Do you wanna survive the apocalypse? If so, you need the wellness company's emergency medical kit. Awake doctors like Dr. Peter McCullough started the wellness company to create real change in healthcare. And part of that change is making sure that you get to take control of your health. They offer a wide variety of services like telehealth and specially formulated natural supplements to help with lingering effects of the you know what. And most recently, they launched the emergency medical kit, which contains eight potentially life-saving medications for you to keep on hand in times of need. Whether it be natural disasters, supply chain shortages, medical emergencies, or the apocalypse, you can rest assured knowing that you have emergency antibiotics, antivirals, and antiparasitics on hand to help keep you and your family safe. And if you're thinking, well, I'm not a doctor, 
How would I know what to take and when? Well, luckily the kit contains an emergency medication guidebook detailing how and when to take which medications. The well-being of my health and my family's health is my number one priority, and having the emergency medical kit on hand gives me tremendous peace of mind. So if you want to be prepared for the unexpected, go to twc.health slash jpreacts to order yours today. And while you're there, be sure to use a discount code JPREACTS for 15% off. Also, please note the emergency medical kit is available only in the USA. That is twc.health slash JPREACTS. Enjoy.